Hello. Um, earlier today I put a video out um, on my thoughts on the coronation and so forth. And I went away, did some thinking, and I'm going to kind of do an update video. Um, I've put the hat on because I, looking back at the video, I realised how weird my hair looks. So, if it's alright with you, from now on I'll have a hat on when I do the videos. Not too bad, is it? Okay. First of all, I do apologise, as I said in the video I put up earlier today, that I f actually forgot to do videos. Um, I'm a bit like that. But I, I am trying to do more of them. Um, I will try and do some... TV show reviews about what I see and so forth. Um, in fact, I'll do a bit of a one in this video later on in a bit. But um, this video is, is important. Uh, for those who don't know, um, I am on the autistic scale, which means my head does not work right. Um, this was caused by my birth. Um, for those who don't know, my mum was in labour for three days. Uh, she was pumped through so many drugs that they actually went into me. And I suffered from it along after. Put it this way, when I was born, you could have put me in boiling water and I probably wouldn't even blink. I wouldn't have felt it. Uh, and I suffered that for many years afterwards. And today it still affects me because I have a very high tolerance for medications. I also develop resistance to them. Now I have multiple other health problems, eyes, and I have trouble with my legs. With my legs, they try me on so many different medications over the years that Basically, every year and a half, every 18 months, uh, which is a year and a half for those who are watching the video, um, they had to change my medication because I was developing a resistance to it and it was not working. In the end, they had to literally, the only one that was working for multiple years, they actually had to take me off because... Well, actually, it was dangerous to my heart, and I have a genetic heart condition, a heart murmur. Uh, I have no idea what that means, but anyway. So, I have suffered life, um, but anyway. So, I do suffer, and uh, it does affect me. I am very forgetful and so forth, which is why these videos are not as often as I like. Plus, the only way I can make these videos is using my mobile phone and editing them is a bit difficult. Right. So that reason why these videos are few and far between and when I do do them uh, uh, I will try and do I promise you I will try and do more of them and I do try and keep my promises right now TV shows I do watch a lot of TV as you can imagine if I've got my legs I don't go out a lot so I do watch TV Yes, I have Netflix. Yes, I have Disney Plus and Paramount Plus. No, I do not have uh, Amazon or Apple Plus because they are more expensive and I have money problems. I mean, basically with Paramount, Disney and Netflix, my with my internet bill, my Sky bill is about, yeah, about 100 quid. Not exactly cheap. 
but it is affordable for me. Now, I'm going to talk about a TV show that is repeated regularly on a TV channel called Walker, Texas Ranger, starring the legend, the icon, the man who doesn't press up, he doesn't push himself up, he pushes the world away, according to Wikipedia. Chuck Norris. Yes, that's right. Chuck Norris did do a TV series. It started in the late 90s and went into the early noughties, which means that he also did deal with uh, 9-11 in the last couple of seasons. I find this show very interesting and very unique because, well, it has humour, it deals with difficult subjects, and it's about one of the oldest forms of law enforcement that the United States and I think the world has as well. The Texas Rangers are over 100 years old. And their number, I think their number is still under 200 nowadays. But don't hold me to that. When he was doing this show, the Texas Rangers were about a hundred personnel. Now the Texas Rangers worked exclusively in Texas for obvious reasons. And um, it's a good show. Unfortunately some of the cast members have passed away and it is a shame because it is an incredible show. And it did deal with things that are still Relevant today. Drugs was a key one. Um, gang violence. Uh, later on, it deals in the latter seasons. It deals with, unfortunately, a very sad subject, um, which was um, children suicide, which is still relevant today. It also dealt with uh, gun crime, which, if you do follow the news, is still very relevant in the US. And unfortunately, it's actually growing here in the UK. But um, it had fun and excitement. Um, it crossed over with another TV show that was being done at the time called Martial Law. That was a known Chinese martial artist Sam Hong who I, I believe is still alive today and did a lot of movies with the legend Jackie Chan these two were good friends and I know for a fact they still do it today uh, I like it uh, the first couple of seasons are slow but then again, most TV shows you watch do have very slow beginnings. Um, if you watch Star Trek The Next Generation, the first couple of seasons, eh, they didn't do too well. Same with Star Trek, uh, same with Deep Space Nine and Voyager. Uh, Discovery is another good one. Um, but as it got on, when... As they would put it, got its traction, knew where to do. Um, it took off. It's eight seasons long. Um, it's shown in the UK on a channel called Legend. Um, it's important, it's fun, it's exciting, and it is a good show. As far as I know, there's only four of the main cast still around. Uh, in fact, they actually incorporated this with one of the key people who did who plays the character T.D. Parker uh, as part of the storyline. Fun, it's enjoyable, and if you can watch it, watch it. Um, I don't, I don't think it's on DVD, which is a shock because this show would be brilliant, would be perfect for that.
Um, the next show I'll do, I'll talk about, is the legendary and iconic Mash. So that's a video you look forward to. Uh, well, that about covers it. Like, share, subscribe, and put in the comments. Now, um, when it comes to the comments, please be nice and be kind and gentle. Um, I do not take racist comments at all. Um, and people being offensive and so forth, I do not tolerate that. So, thank you very much. I like you. Like, share, subscribe, pass it on. I rather enjoy it. Like I said, next show I'll talk about will be MASH, which is regularly repeated. Thank you so much, and I will see you soon.